Hi everyone, so I'm back to share another journal with you. Um, this one is a hodgepodge of things. It's all sorts of different things in here from lots of different people. Um, there's Artie Mae's, Tsunami Rose, The Old Design Shop, My Porch Prints, um, Christy Art Designs, and if there's anyone else I'll mention it as we go along. So it's a soft cover and I've used one of, this is one of the pages that is in Artie Maisie's free thank you kit that she done a few months ago. So <clears throat> you can find that on her Facebook group. So I've used that as the cover and if you watched my other videos where I've been using the actual digital prints, I've put them onto like four layers of um, coffee or tea dyed paper but this one on the inside has actually got some um, avocado dyed paper so this is titled timeless um, and obviously it's all been stitched um, I've got these little bead dangles and the video that was up before um, this one is showing you how to make them so if you're interested in that you can go back a video and see that there is some crochet to trim and um, eyelets and twine as a closure and let me see if I can open this without causing a knot Ta -da! okay so the journal which I did write down somewhere but, but then I got distracted with making beads and I've lost it but I know it measures eight by uh, four and three quarters and it's 60 pages front and back it's got one signature and it will be listed in my shop if you're interested I'm just going to adjust my light because um I think it needs it so there we have it love the noise of them beads so let's do a flip like i said the inside is avocado dyed paper and these bead dangles can obviously be taken off because they're on there with bulb pins so they are detachable this is from tsunami rose and it is um god i didn't mention that i don't think at the beginning because i've rambled on that much now um tsunami rose which is charming fragments that comes in two sizes it comes in a traveler's notebook size and also um a normal journal size <clears throat> excuse me um we've got some cheesecloth on here i've used again the same uh page that i've used for the cover i've used to make some pockets and i need to trim that because it was uh that's why I got dis distracted with the bead tangles because I was waiting for this to dry and then I forgot all about that so I could just give it a little pull and make it tatty. So <clears throat> that's been um, sewn and that's been sewn onto some tea or coffee dyed paper on the back and we have a selection of ephemera and journal cards. This is from Tsunami Rose. That doesn't want to go in. Not fingers and thumbs today. I think it was cut my hands all funny from doing them beads. <laughs> I think this is Christy Art Designs. This is my porch print. And this is a little tag that I made yesterday um, as part of the Fab Tag 30 Days. I made um, three of these and three other tags. And some of them are in here. Oh, the wind's getting up outside. Oh, we're not getting a storm. Oh, that's a bit crazy how that's just got really wild crochet trim the bead dangle we got some stamping this is the old design shop uh, digital music paper the old design shop there's plenty of places to journal in this this is one of the tags that I made yesterday as part of the challenge this is a nice vintage lady on there that's from Artie Mace and I've just sewn that onto some coffee dyed paper got some cheesecloth here butterfly little piece of bling the word piece and then some of this nice little black trim that I have I don't often use black and that's why I thought I'd use it because I've got it and I should use what I have right <laughs> uh, Tsunami Rose here I've used again one of the freebie pages no it's not it is a freebie from the free kit that Artie Mays, Artie Mays gave us I made a double pocket here and I've got a selection again of tags in there here we have um, this is from the old design shop and do lots of journaling on that you could cut it up and turn it into something else you could make tags out of that as well um, these are Artie Mays as well I like these nice she brought these out I think it was like at the start of lockdown because they were all quite inspiring especially when people were feeling you know scared worried concerned um, I thought these were really good um, a journal card here I think that's Christy Art Designs 
and then again that's one of the little tags that i made these actually are from my porch prints and it's the grandma's attic kit and i had some of that left over um like the tags and stuff so i used that little butterfly a little piece of crocheted trim a bit of glue strand <laughs> some bling and that pops in there this is a stamp and i've just used my pink and cheese and put a little butterfly with bling there some more stamping avocado dyed paper again that's from the same paper from the cover and i've just made a pocket with that and again we've just got a selection of journal cards and um, tags and stuff this is from artie mays one of the oddments kits i think it's oddments free this is artie mays as well they're really pretty they are this is from my porch prints this is I think Christy Art Designs. Uh, Tsunami Rose, another pocket. This says make each day a story worth telling and it's double layered with the butterfly and bling. We have a little journal card. <clears throat> I have one of these tags from Artie Mays. This is an Artie Mays freebie as well. You can find that on her website and her Facebook group. This is from one of Artie Mays' kits. I can't remember which one it is now can't remember but it was just in my stash so I've added that so I've got lots of journal space there oh it's got wild out there with the wind I don't know if you can hear it uh, the old design shop some vintage digital music paper that's Italian if you're searching for it, it's Italian uh, vintage Italian music paper <clears throat> couldn't tell you where I got it. I know it was Etsy, but I couldn't tell you the name of the shop. Um, another bead dangle. Crocheted trim, some stamping, some more of the avocado dyed paper. Uh, lots of journaling space that flips out. A nice shine to that. Here we have another pocket. <clears throat> and inside here... The back tag here is um, from Artie Mays, and I've sewn that onto coffee dyed paper. I think this is Artie Mays as well. Again, I'm just using, I was using what was in my big tub of leftovers <laughs> um, from obviously all the other projects that I do. This was a cutout that um, I got from Tsunami Rose, and I know she does the boxes of um, die cuts and stuff like that that you can purchase. I think they're like mystery boxes, so you, you know, you. You get a picture of roughly of what you get but they may vary some bling on there and that is from Artie Mays as well uh, little moments big memories butterfly bling another pocket here and this says inspire this is these little um definition um plates tags whatever you want to call them are from my porch prints Dictionary definitions, that's what they're called. Another little postcard. This is from My Porch Prints. It's upside down and that's from Artie Mays. That is Artie Mays as well. And <clears throat> um, Artie Mays got a new kit out. Oh my, can't wait to play with that one. Um, but I've got to clear what I'm doing at the moment because I've got so much going on. <laughs> uh, a treble pocket, again using one of the pages from the free kit that Artie Mays gave us all. The thank you kit I should say. This is a freebie again from Artie Mays. <clears throat> and two of these tags, again they were the, um, the tags that she made at the beginning of lockdown here in the UK. And here we just have a little journal card. I think that's from My Porch Prints. This is just a little piece from um, Tsunami Rose, one of her kits. And again, it was just a leftover and I've just made a little journal card with it. So you can have it that way or that way. You can do some writing in there. Uh, everything beautiful has its moments. Um, butterfly and bling. Some more crocheted trim and a bead dangle. Another one of those tags that I made yesterday for the challenge. I won't do today's tags yet. Um, that is from the old design shop, I think. Yep, it is. And that's the tag. This one says Joy. I 
fingers just really don't want to work today. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> Flip out some stamping, put some nice markings on that paper because it was on the pizza pan. It's got lines and dots. <clears throat> Another little, um, it's got cheesecloth behind there that says magical. Corner pocket. Another one of these little tags. That is from uh, My Porch Prints, Christy Art Designs and Tsunami Rose. So there we have it. That is this journal. <clears throat> and that is the back page and the um what you call that the um avocado dyed paper so there we go that's the journal i do love the noise of them beads <laughs> easily pleased um so like i said um if you ha have any questions just ask and i will get around to answering it and <clears throat> this will be listed in my shop if you have any questions just ask and thanks for watching bye